three, go. This ribbon cutting marks the completion and opening of Mississauga's Confederation Parkway Bridge. I'm looking forward to, uh, to it being opening. Uh, as you can tell, there's a lot of congestion in our city core right now, and we're hoping that the opening of this bridge uh, will alleviate some of the traffic congestion that uh, people are now experiencing, both on Mavis Road and here in Terrio Street. The bridge was constructed with both aesthetic and pedestrian use considered. It's been beautifully designed. It's in the city core. It's the lead to the city core. So therefore, we felt that we should make it attractive. One of the most talked about features is the pedestrian walkway and the safety precautions taken so walkers feel comfortable crossing. We've introduced this concrete barrier so that uh, particularly in the winter time the uh, pedestrians uh, uh, will be uh, have some protection from snow and ice. Features also include designated bike lanes for cyclists and LED energy efficient lighting. Underneath the bridge is actually some LED lights which will give it a blue tint and also on top of the bridge uh, there are LED features in uh, some of the uh, rail posts so it'll have a nice ambience uh, to the bridge. The city built the bridge in partnership with Go Transit which contributed 1.9 million dollars. The overall cost to this new city trademark, $17 million. This bridge has been in the city's official plan since 1981 and is one of the final pieces completing the road infrastructure into the city centre. In Mississauga, Joanna Rienzo, First Local.